Okay, I'm going to eject this Carly Well disc because this is what boots the machine and um, hopefully the machine will boot into Windows and then I can go on to Easy B C D and set up the dual boot. If I hit restart, it should boot into Windows. And go to add new entry. Now ignore this bit. I'm gonna go here. Now I've downloaded Ch one Charmeleon ISO. I'm gonna copy that. I'm gonna put it on the root of the Windows hard drive. Okay, it's in there now. So. Back to here, I'm going to click on ISO, change this name, just, let's just call it Mac Boot, I can always go back and change the name. We want it to run from disk, so we're going to look for the path now. Path. I'm going to go to computer. I'm going to do that. Right, that's all set. So I can close this window down now. I'm going to add this entry. If it doesn't work, I can always remove it. Like this test. Let's go to MacBook and see what happens. Mm -hmm. Let's go across to left bed. And Leopard has loaded. So there we go. We've successfully dual booted Caliwell Leopard 10.5 and Windows 7. Thanks for watching.